hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is joshua matthew thanks if you are who there and if you are new here please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification so that you get notified when i upload a new video in this tutorial we are going to learn how to design a clinic service flyer i'm going to use a5 yeah then i will change it to inches then i'm going to reduce the resolution to 200 then i click on grids all right now that we have something like this i'm going to bring my image here that's the image i'm going to use in this tutorial then i'll drag it into photoshop then take it up like this all right then i'm going to click on the background here then before then i will copy my background color ctrl c then go to solid color then you control v to paste the background color all right now i have the background like this then select your right angle then you drag like this Then the color I'm going to use in this place is this. Then Ctrl V is the color. Now what I will do next is to rasterize this then go to my and pick the lesser tool then i'll click here then i'll click here like this then delete so now that I did it, I will press Ctrl D to deselect. Then I'll come down here again. I'll select my right angle. Then I'll drag like this. I will pick, copy my color there. Then paste. Then this is the color I'm going to use. Now, I will have another rectangle. Then drag like this. Then I will change this color to black. Then rotate it this angle all right now that i have something like this then I will duplicate this one, drag it down to this place, then you duplicate, then take it over the side, then flip horizontal, then rotate it like this.
then I have something like this then I'm going to change this color to this color here then what I will do I'll select my paint pocket tool then click on this one then then now click on the on the right angle now the color has already been applied what I'll do is to drag it down here all right so now that I have this one then the next thing to do I'm going to bring this design to Photoshop then I'll drag it here then I'm going to select overlay then reduce the opacity to 77 or 76 then I have something like this so now the next thing to do I will also bring another rectangle over here then I'll change it to this color drag it down a bit then I will reduce the fill seventy then I will copy my test ctrl C to copy then press T on your keyboard to select the test tool then ctrl V to paste I'm going to change the color to white then scale it out like this then I will change this color here then ctrl C to copy the code then ctrl V to paste now I will drag it here to look for the type of color I want then ok something like this is ok now the next thing again I will be bring another red angle like this then I will change it to white color then I will copy this text here T on your keyboard for test two then control V then I will change the color to black drop your test two then now I will drag it out so I have something like this Hold your shift key, then you drag the rent angle up, then OK. So, this is what I have. Your logo should be here all 
Okay. Now I'm going to group them. Hold your shift key, then you click Ctrl G to group. Then I will name this one company name or company slogan, any one you want. So now that I have something like this, so the next thing to do again. I will copy my test to T on your keyboard for the test to then I will control V to paste then V to drop your test to then drag it out Then again, control C to copy. In. Then drag this one, drag this one here to duplicate or control J. Again, Ctrl C to copy. Drag this one here again. Then Ctrl V to paste. Then I will copy the test to here, Ctrl C, then I will change the color here, then OK. Now I will also duplicate this one, Ctrl J. Proceed to copy, then paste. I'm going to change this color. Then I will change this color. To black. Okay. Now that I have something like this, then duplicate this one again, control J. Then highlight copy, then you paste it. Again, duplicate this one. I like it.
you copy it, then paste. Then come back to Office, drag it down to Duplicate, or you press Ctrl J. Ctrl J again. Then you copy, Ctrl C, then Ctrl V to paste. Now, copy again, then Ctrl V to paste. Then I'm going to change the color here to white. Then scale it out. Then I will duplicate this one. Then I'll take it up. And I will change the color to white. Then I will copy this count. Then T on my keyboard for test two. Then Ctrl V to paste. Okay, now I have something like this. The next thing again to do. to copy the contact come back to school clean then you drag it here to duplicate ctrl a to highlight then ctrl v to paste Reduce the size. Then I'm going to highlight the telephone test. Then I'm going to change the color to this color. Then OK. Then I will also duplicate it here like this. Then I will copy the address. Control V. Copy, then select this test here, drag it here to copy, then you drag it up, move it down here, Ctrl A, then Ctrl V. Now, I'm going to change the color to black. Then reduce the size. So now, I have something like this. Then go back to this one. Select drop shadow. Then a shadow is 31. I mean, the size is 31. Then I will reduce the spread to 7. 
and the distance the distance to 2 then okay that is it that is how to design a flyer for cleaning service thanks for watching if you are not subscribed please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified anytime i upload a new video thank you